जय हिंद स्टूडेंट्स टुडे इन स्टैंडर्ड सिक्स दिस इज द रिवीजन वीडियो नंबर थ्री ऑफ यूनिट टेस्ट सेकंड सो डियर स्टूडेंट्स इन प्रीवियस वीडियोस वी हैव डन द रिवीजन ऑफ आंसर्स इन डिटेल्स आंसर इन शॉर्ट गिव साइंटिफिक रीजंस एंड वन सेंटेंस क्वेश्चंस राइट सो इन दिस वीडियो we will do the revision of all the objectives questions means we will start from the mcq fill in the blanks true or false and then one word answers and then definitions so we will start with the today's revision with mcqs so choose the correct options we and we have from the chapter number 9th and 10th and it carries one marks and choose the correct option will come five questions so the first questions which type of railway engines were invented in the beginning so we have studied in our chapter that in the beginning which type of engine were invented see the options are steam engine electric engine diesel engine and monorail right so in the beginning as we have studied steam engine was invented so the answer is steam engine now the second question we have is which of the following is not the invention of 20th century the options are spacecraft electric train monorail and goods train so from this spacecraft electric train and monorail were the invention of 20th century so our answer is b goods train it is the not the invention of 20th century third question we have is which of the following is largest unit of length meter kilometer centimeter and millimeter see as we have studied in the chapter that meter is the unit of length and its smaller unit are centimeter and millimeter so the largest unit of length is kilometer so the answer is b kilometer now the next question we have is which of the following units of length smaller than a centimeter so the options we have millimeter meter kilometer and decimeter as we know that meter kilometer and decimeter are not smaller so a the answer is millimeter is smaller than centimeter so the answer is a millimeter the fifth question we have is which is the standard device to measure length which is the standard device to measure length so options we have compass box protector meter square and set square so with compass box protector and set square we cannot measure the length properly but we can measure the length properly with the help of meter scale so our answer is c meter scale now the next question we have is which is a practical unit to measure the distance between two cities which is the practical unit to measure the distance between two cities see as the measure between two cities are longer so we will use bigger unit and that is kilometer right so the answer is kilometer what does the tailor used to take measurement to your body see when we are going to stitch our clothes to tailor what does it use to measure our body see the options we have metal scale measuring tape plastic scale and scale so he is using measuring tape so the answer is b measuring tape now the next question we have is which of the following motion is executed by falling from a tree branch see as we know that a fruit fallen comes straight down to the ground so as as we have learned in the chapter that an object which moves straight way is known as rectilinear motion so our answer is rectilinear motion now the ninth question is what is the type of motion executed by the blades of a fan 
the options are rectilinear motion curved motion circular motion and periodic motion so the blades of a fan execute circular motion now the next question we have is the invention of which of the following modes of transport made space travel possible so aeroplane helicopter spacecraft and hovercraft from this from the name itself we can identify that with the help of spacecraft the transport of space can be possible so the answer is c space craft now the next question we have is what do you mean by supersonic plane the options we have plane that flies higher than the clouds b fighter plane plane that flies at 1000 km per hour and d plane that flies at speeds greater than sound so as we have studied in the chapter that the plane that flies greater than sound is known as supersonic plane so our answer is d plane that flies at speeds greater than sound now the next question we have 12th number which of the following trees are found in mountain region so the options we have oak pine deodar pipal date palm and babul coconut babul and sesam d palm tree neem and bustard tree right so from this the option a oak pine and deodar are found in mountain region now the next question we have which animal is known as the sheep of desert as we have studied that desert animals camel is a desert animal and it is known as the sheep of the desert because it has adapted itself the desert condition to live in that condition so it is known as the sheep of the desert now the next question we have 14th one which of the following creature is a sea animal which of the following creature is a sea animal so options we have frog snail crab and crane so from this crab is a sea animal 15th one which of the following animals can live both in water as well as on land so the options we have frog fish octopus jellyfish so frog is the animal which can live both on land as well as on water in water which of the following animals do not have a streamlined body see the options we have octopus fish whale and dolphin so fish whale and dolphin has streamlined body and octopus do not have so the answer is octopus a octopus now the next question we have is which of the following animals breathe through gills fish so the first option is fish and that is the answer fish breathe through gills now the next question is in which of the following terrains is a snow leopard found so where do we found snow leopard so the options we have desert mountains forest and grasslands so from this we can see the leopard in mountains so b mountains is the answer now the next question we have which of the following creature is found in mountain terrain so deer lion yak and rabbit are the options so from this which animal is found in mountain yak we can see yak in the mountain terrain so answer c yak is the answer which of the following is a biotic component biotic component means which is living thing a cloud b mimosa c aeroplane and d train so from this a cloud c aeroplane and d train are non living things and b mimosa is living things so it is a plant it is a biotic component now the next question we have is flowers of which of the following plants bloom at night so the options we have rose mimosa sunflower and lily so the answer is lily lily flowers bloom only at night the next question we have is which of the following is not true for an asopalav tree 
as we know that it is a tree so the options we have it respires it moves it reproduces and it grows so from this it shows the three characteristics it respires it reproduces and it grow but it does not show the characteristics it move so the answer is b it moves which of the following is a nocturnal animal means the animal which is active at night so snake chameleon frog rat so d rat is the answer the next question we have which organ of a fish helps it to absorb the oxygen dissolved in water so uh, the options we have fins gills lungs mouth so the answer b gills is the answer which helps fish to absorb the oxygen which is dissolved in water gills helps to absorb water which is dis, uh, oxygen which is dissolved in water now the next and the last question of mcq is what is the presence of specific features and habits which enables a plant or an animal to live in a particular habit called it is called as adaptation it is called as adaptation right so this 25 mcq are there and from this it will any five will come in the exam now we will do the revision of the fill in the blanks and fill in the blanks are from 9 and 10 chapter and it also carry one mark questions and it has five marks so five questions will come so first question is see in the red color i have written the answer that means there is a blank so blank and blank are the biotic components of a habitat so the answers are plants and animals see i have highlighted with the red color that means they are the answer and there is a blank so we have to write the blank answers and the answers are plants and animals are the biotic components of a habitat because as we have studied in the chapter that the living things are biotic components and non living things are abiotic components so plants and animals are living things so they are considered as biotic components and the next question we have is land is an blank components of a habitat it is abiotic component because land is non living thing and it is considered as abiotic component a fish respire through blank so fish respire through its gills it has the organ name gills fish swims with the help of blank and change its direction with the help of its blank so it swims with the help of fins and change its direction with the help of tail now the next question we have is fifth one that is whale respire through its nostril or you can write blow holes also whale respire through its nostril or blow hole which is located on their upper part of their head now when blank plant is touched it leaves closed or fold so blank means answer will come mimosa plant or you can write touch me not plant also right mimosa or touch me not it is a similar word of the plant name so mimosa or touch me not is a plant which fold its leaves when it is touched soil water and air are the blank factors of a habitat so it will come abiotic factors of a habitat soil water and air are abiotic factors invention of the blank made a great change in the modes of transport so we can say invention of wheel invention of wheel made a great change in the modes of transport so the answer is wheel a train running on a single rail is called blank a train running on a single rail is called monorail a train which runs on a single rail is called mono rail blank is the si unit of length meter meter is the si unit of length 1 meter is equal to blank millimeters 1 meter is equal to 1000 millimeter 1 millimeter is equal 1 meter is equal to 1000 millimeters 
द यूनिट ऑफ लेंथ यूज टू मेजर द डिस्टेंस बिटवीन अहमदाबाद एंड मुंबई इज सी वी आर यूजिंग द यूनिट अकॉर्डिंग टू द डिस्टेंस एंड द डिस्टेंस बिटवीन अहमदाबाद एंड मुंबई इज लॉन्ग डिस्टेंस तो वी विल मेजर द बिगर यूनिट एंड दैट इज किलोमीटर किलोमीटर इज द आंसर द यूनिट ऑफ लेंथ नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज थर्टीन वन द यूनिट ऑफ लेंथ यूज टू मेजर द थिकनेस ऑफ अ टेबल ग्लास इज सी द थिकनेस ऑफ अ टेबल ग्लास इज स्मॉलर सो वी विल यूज द स्मॉलर यूनिट एंड दैट इज मिलीमीटर द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन द यूनिट ऑफ लेंथ यूज टू मेजर द लेंथ ऑफ द विंडो ऑफ योर क्लास रूम सो लेंथ ऑफ द विंडो कैन बी मेजर विद द हेल्प ऑफ मीटर वन मीटर इज ब्लैंक सेंटीमीटर सो वन मीटर इज इक्वल टू हंड्रेड सेंटीमीटर एंड द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वी हैव इज फाइव किलोमीटर इज ब्लैंक मीटर फ्लाइ इन वन किलोमीटर देर आर थाउजेंड मीटर सो फाइव किलोमीटर मीन्स फाइव मल्टीप्लाई बाई थाउजेंड सो आंसर विल बी फाइव थाउजेंड मीटर द वायर्स ऑफ ए गिटार एग्जीक्यूट ब्लैंक मोशन सी वायर्स ऑफ ए गिटार एग्जीक्यूट पीरियोडिक मोशन बिकॉज इट रिपीट्स इट्स मोशन इन ए रेग्युलर इंटरवल सो इट इज पीरियोडिक इट शोज पीरियोडिक मोशन मोशन ऑफ ए चाइल्ड ऑन ए स्विंग is blank so motion of a child on a swing shows periodic motion because it's repeat its motion in a regular interval motion of the needle of a sewing machine is it shows periodic motion it also shows periodic motion motion of the wheel of a bicycle it shows circular motion it shows circular motion so these are the fill in the blanks questions from 9th and 10th chapter we have and now we will do the revision of true or false and it will come from the 9th 10th and 11th chapter and it also carries one marks and five question will come so first question we have cactus plant is found in desert yes cactus plant is found in desert so it is true a camel can survive without drinking water for a long time yes we have learned in the chapter that camel can survive without water for a long time so it is true a fish respire through its fins so it is false because fish respire through its gills so the answer is false during respiration the plants absorb oxygen and get up gives out carbon dioxide yes it is true because all living organisms take oxygen during respiration and gives out carbon dioxide during photosynthesis green plant absorb carbon dioxide and gives out oxygen so this is true because in process of photosynthesis it need carbon dioxide and it gives produce oxygen so it is true in a cactus the stem carries out the process of photosynthesis yes it is true because cactus plant does not have leaves so photosynthesis carried out in stem now the next question we have is that is seventh one the leaves in mountain plants are either absent very small or they are present in the shape of spines it is false because this kind of leaves we can see in desert plant not in mountain plant so it is false snakes and rats lives in burrows it is true due to extent intense heat they go in burrows kilometer is the si unit of length it is false because meter is the si unit of length so this is the ninth answer is false tenth one a flying butterfly performs rectilinear motion it is false because it performs curvilinear or curved motion 11th question the pendulum of a clock execute periodic motion it is true because the pendulum repeats at regular interval the earth performs rectilinear motion around the sun it is false because it performs periodic motion as well as circular motion it does not go straight path it is rotating or moving in a circular path the flying cats always performs rectilinear motion yes so dear students while flying kite right? as you all have flight kites so it is going straight way right 
so it performs rectilinear motion it is true a child sitting in a merry go round performs circular motion yes you all have sat in a circle merry go round so it is moving round round so it is true circular motion 15th question a millimeter is smaller unit than a centimeter it is true so millimeter is smaller than so it is true the shape of the shadow of an object it is always the same as that of the object false because the shape of the shadow is not same it depends on the light right it depends on the light and, and from which direction it falls a pinhole camera forms an erect image of a burning candle it is false because a pinhole camera forms inverted image it forms inverted image so this is false mirror reflects the light falling on it it is true mirror reflects the light which falls on it lens is used in pinhole camera it is false right lens cannot used in pinhole camera now so students this were the true or false now we will do the revision of definition so we have from 9th and 11th chapter definitions are there and from this two will come and each carries one mark so first question adaptation what is the meaning of adaptation you have to define the adaptation the presence of specific features and habits which enable a plant or an animal to live in a particular habitat is called adaptation means they have the specific features through which they can live in a specific condition which is known as adaptation now stimuli change in surroundings that makes respond to them are called stimuli see change in surrounding if you are doing any work and sudden change around you so that you are responding so that is known as stimuli change in surrounding that makes response to living organisms by living organism is known as stimuli right now third one is excretion the process of getting rid of their waste by the living organism is known as excretion means see all living organisms remove from their body waste right and that process is known as excretion removal of waste the process of removal of waste is known as excretion now the next question we have is reproduction the production of new individual of similar in form is called reproduction the production of new one of similar one in form is called reproduction habitat the surroundings where plants and animals live is called their habitat or we can say where plants and animals live is called its habitat shadow when opaque object comes in the path of light and dark patch is formed is called shadow when opaque object comes in the way of light and a dark patch is formed is called shadow now reflection of light the phenomenon of bouncing back of light ray when after heating a surface is called reflection means when light bounces back after falling on a surface when light bounces back after falling on a surface is called reflection of light now eighth one transparent object object which allows light to pass through it is called transparent object or we can see the object through which we can see clearly is called transparent object opaque object object which does not allow light to pass through it is called opaque object and then the last one is translucent object object which allows light to pass partially through it is called translucent object so if you want to give the example understand with example transparent object we can say air is a transparent glass is a transparent through which light can pass and then opaque object object which does not allow light to pass see we can say book a wall or our body is also a trans uh, sorry opaque object because our body does not allow light to pass through it 
and translucent means the object which allow partially light to pass through it for example butter paper smoke right these are the example of translucent object and these are the definitions we have 10 definitions and any two will come from this definitions now we have one word question and that is concept based and it will come from the 9 10th and 11th chapter and each carries one marks and there are five questions of this type of questions so first questions we have name two animals found in hilly areas so i have written the answers yak and mountain goat are found in hilly areas but you can write any two animals found in hilly areas second question in which areas do you find oak and deodorant trees so oak and deodorant trees are found in mountain regions so i have written mountains is the answer from where do fish get oxygen for respiration see fish lives in water so oxygen is dissolved in water so the answer is from water fish get oxygen which organ helps fish to respire so fish do not have nose but it have gills and gills helps to respire so gills is the answer the next question we have is in which plant is photosynthesis carried out by the stem cactus plant does not have leaves so in cactus plant photosynthesis is carried out by stem which organ helps earthworm to respire skin skin helps earth to respire it does not have nose but it respire through skin what is the respiratory organ in plant leaves leaves are the respiratory organ in plants in which areas does cactus grow cactus grows in desert cactus grows in desert which means of transport was used to travel along water routes in ancient time boat by boat see people used to travel in ancient time through water routes by boat which means of transport is used for air travel aeroplane aeroplane is used to transport in for air travel what are the planes that travel at a speed more than the sound called the planes that travels more than sound speed is called supersonic plane convert 7450 meters in kilometers so it will be 7.450 meter because 1 meter is equal to 1 upon 1000 kilometer therefore 4 7450 meters is equal to 7450 upon 1000 so the answer you will get 7.450 meter now the next question we have is what is the type of motion executed by the wheels of a scooter so the wheels of a scooter execute circular motion what type of motion is executed by a child sitting in a merry go round it also execute circular motion the the next question we have is which are the units of length used to measure the thickness of a scale found in your compass box so thickness of scale is measured with the help of millimeter how many meters are there in 1 kilometer 1000 meters are there in 1 kilometer so the answer is 1000 now the next question we have 17th one how many centimeter are there in 2.5 meters in 1 meter 100 centimeters so 2.5 meter 2.5 multiply by 100 so you will get 250 centimeter how many centimeters are there in 1.65 meters in 1.65 meters 165 centimeter what do we call the object that does not allow light pass through it we call opaque object the object which does not allow to pass light through it is known as opaque object now the next question we have is what do we call the object that allows light light pass through it is easily so it is known as transparent object the object which allow light to pass through it is known as transparent object now the next question we have is which objects form shadow opaque object forms shadow what happens when an opaque object 
is placed in the path of light shadow is formed when an opaque object is placed in the path of light shadow is formed what is the shape of the path of propagation of light straight line see it travels in a straight line what are the object next question what are the objects that emits their own light called luminous object so the object which emits its own light is known as luminous object what forms erect and virtual image of an object that is of the same size as the object plane mirror see plane mirror forms erect and virtual object which is the most important natural source of light sun sun is the most and important and it is the natural source of light so dear students here we will complete the revision of all the objective types and we have done the revision of our hall type of question so we have completed the revision of science over here this is the last video and I hope you will understand all the question and answers right so today we have done the revision of mcq fill in the blanks true or false and one word and definitions right so thank you and best of luck for your exam thank you